Hello everyone, this is Ruth Shikalon Babies coming on. I hope all the aunties and uncles and cousins and everyone doing fine. Um, I know I haven't done a video in a minute. Um, wanted to come on with Trinity and then uh, I'm going to try to change two babies. Um, yes, I know Memorial is coming up. But I'm just going to change two babies um, in the colors. I got blue and white, blue and white, red, red and white and blue. And uh, oh, I'm losing my train of thought. <laughs> I reviewed that in the name of Jesus. But y'all, um, y'all sister have been feeling well. Um, last week I uh, went through the migraine headaches and just when I thought I was over with it leaned me on uh, I went to service Sunday they prayed for me you know the Lord came in and really blessed and uh, late on that evening I got home it was leaning on so it actually um, it didn't leave until uh, Monday then after that y'all I know um, we live in this, in this life we're going to go through sickness and pain and some some diseases uh, I don't claim none of, none of it because the word of God say by his stripes we are healed even though we go through the symptoms and the pain and all the agony I speak healing over my life and that's what we have to do that's the word of God and our pastor that's what he teaches speak the word of God you know we, we, we go through pains we gonna feel it and this and that but keep on keep on having faith and speak the word of God over your life cause these migraines uh, uh, arthritis all these others um, illness do not belong to the children of God they, this disease and all this stuff it belongs to the devil so we don't claim nothing we don't speak that negative over our life we speak positive we speak the word of God over our life yeah we're gonna go through it but you keep on speaking the word of God over your life um, and that's what I have to do I have to keep on doing that you know until God see fit to deliver me and all uh, so I got Trinity y'all needs him and like I said I haven't been feeling well y'all um after I got over the, the migraine headaches I started having sharp pains in my right hip and it got to the point I couldn't even hardly walk I was just in so much pain and um I'm thinking this is this is what I'm thinking Maybe it's coming from cause of the arthritis. Uh, but anyway, um, and I've had to call the doctor, and you know when you call the doctor that last minute or so, they don't have no open spot. But you can go and see a doctor, but you ain't guaranteed to see him because you'll sit there all day. And I ain't trying to do that. So the nurse had called me and they told me if it get worse and I'm feeling a lot of pain, just go to the um, urgent care. And so I thought about going to the urgent care, which I did got dressed and everything, and uh, went over there by the hospital, because that's where the urgent care is next to the hospital. Don't y'all know when I got there, I seen a line outside the door. <laughs> I say, uh-uh, I no, no, no. Uh, I rolled through the parking ro uh, parking lot and rolled through, <laughs> rolled out. I said, nah, I ain't finna, I ain't finna stand out there. And I, um, by the grace of God, He did bless me. It eased up. Uh, oh, shoot, baby girl, what is Mama doing? I'm so sorry. I'm pulling the um, onesie over my baby head without snapping the arm, um, the back of her. I'm sorry, Mama. I tell you, Mama be all right. But yeah, it's um, it's not painting as bad, but I can still feel a little bit um when I'm standing. 
So, uh, I'm going to try not to make this video so long. But anyway, um, I'm going to change Trinity. I just, to tell you the truth, y'all, I just changed the babies yesterday. Just changed them. All, um, not all of them, but some of the babies, yeah. I changed them yesterday and I think the day before. I ended up putting them on something. Because I thought my mom was going to come over with her neighbor. And she, my mom been telling her about my babies. And um, my husband this week wasn't feeling well. Um, but he still, you know, he didn't mind for them to come over. But he was just in bed all week, y'all. He um, went for his last shot. And that was on a Monday. So he went to work Tuesday. Uh, now, baby girl do have a clean undershirt. I'm sorry. I'm trying to really get her in frame. She do have a clean undershirt and she have clean pampers. Like I said, I did change the baby some of them just yesterday. So, um, but I'm going to put her on this little outfit. I got this at Once Upon a Child. I think it's so cute. And I didn't even know she had a little cute little grumple. And it got like the little little snaps in the um, crouch for her. I'm going to put this on her and then probably do her hair. I'm going to come on with her brother and change him. But uh, yeah, my husband wasn't feeling good. He went to work um, on uh, Tuesday. So he wasn't feeling well. I guess from the shot, he, he was experiencing some of the um, side effects. But um, I can tell he wasn't really feeling good because he stayed in bed like all day. I mean, from what, Tuesday to yesterday? He was all in bed. He was in bed and we kind of slept in this morning. So he feeling a lot better. I can tell he is because um, he out now, out there. Um, washing the cars and talking to the neighbors so I decided to come in here and do a video and uh, get the babies dressed and you know what I don't know I can't find them I thought I had red socks I do but I can't find them at, at the moment so I'm just gonna put them on and baby girl I'm gonna have to get her some sandals but she don't have no sandals. And you know what? Hold on. Let me see if she can try to wear uh, a pair of sandals or elbow. Hold on. Okay, I'm back. I grabbed um, Ella Koala sandals, but they size zero. I don't know. I never tried them on Trinity. So I don't know if they fit her feet because her feet are way a little bigger than um, Ella's. Yeah, they fit them. I didn't think they was because they were so small. Oh, she had to wear some sandals. Her sister, boy, I'll tell you, one thing good about having girls, they wear each other clothes <laughs> and their shoes. Now, some some things they wear. Uh, with Trinity, she got her own outfit. Now, uh, the, the smaller babies, newborn, they can't wear her clothes. So it, it really, like, um, uh, Joy Joy and uh, Kamari, they got their own size clothes so nobody else can wear their clothes. And um, Trinity, she's um, she's from three to six months. Now some zero to three months she can wear. And I'm just going to um, do a hair when I'm going to. I know I'm blocking her, but um, y'all just be patient. Um, okay, I'm back. I'm gonna see if I can do a hair where I got her sitting up. And the uh, koala Santa looks so nice. Let me see if I can bring this down. Y'all can see her Santa. Uh, Santa. She wearing Ella Santa. He's so cute on her. I'm so glad that she can wear him because it's it ain't summer yet, but it's getting there. 
it been in the nineties. But I was talking about my husband, how we um think he was sparing some of the side effect on the vaccine and um I was I was out anyway because I was going I was going to get something to eat because um I didn't cook and I'm gonna tell you from driving it really bothered me um because my right side was in in a lot of pain and I thought for a minute I'd be going to the urgent care but like I said I rolled through the parking lot Ooh. And I rolled out, and it do hurt to bend. It really do. So I'm, I told my husband, um, I'm I'm collecting bodies, y'all. And I'm um, I got they display right, right down in this section. Um, I took my chair out of here, so it's in the um, it's in our bedroom. And I got three babies in there with us. Um. If I had it, had enough room. Oh, man, what do I do with your bones? I got you sitting on it. That's why. That's why, Mama. Don't you want to get you blue? Uh, that's two different red. Oh. Let's see. I don't know, man. I should put the blue on her. The dog blue. But she can also wear the red. I thought I had the colors out, y'all. I didn't. So anyway, I had two different. That ain't no red. That looked like a reddish orange color. So anyway, let's see if I can get her back in front and sit her up. And she, I don't even have one. Back snapped. Come on, baby. Yeah, so um, that's what been going on. Uh, um, I'm just trying to feel better. So, y'all just have to be patient when you don't see me making a video. Just pray for me. Pray for my family. So, you know, I go through days like that, and um, if I don't feel good, I'm just not going to make a video. I'm not. So, um,. Pretty much nothing until I get you know better and able to do it. But um, yeah, I can stand a little bit, but when I'm bending over and stuff like that, yeah, I can feel the pain in my um, my right hip. So anyway, the nurse did call and um, they got a uh, they was able to get me in Tuesday, so I got to go in. Tuesday, so I guess they had a cancellation. So, um, because my next appointment would have been, uh, I think in July before I see her again. But I thank God that they got me an early appointment because I'm thinking it's from the because the arthritis, you know. And, uh, but like the nurse said, it could be something else. You don't know. I'm just, I'm just speculating. I ain't no nurse or nothing like that. I ain't took no training. Be a nurse, so I don't know. But I know I felt like this before when I couldn't walk for for days, y'all. I was in so much pain. Lord Jesus, I don't want to go through that no more. Literally, I was crawling. That's just how much pain I was in. So it, it wasn't like that this time. It was just the sharp pain in my hip, and then shoot down to my legs. So that's what I'm feeling. But anyway, um, man, sometimes it be feeling like it's long. Baby girl, I ain't gonna fish out of here. I just um just put a little water and did it like this. I always put my baby either this type of ponytail or yeah, I've been having like little pony little pigtails. It was so cute. And I put all my babies on the undershirt. So if you see that white, that's an undershirt. But that's okay. I mean, it brings it out. Because she got white lining in the, uh, her little romper. She looking so cute. Yes, you is. Looking so cute, girl. All right, hold on. Let me get Jonah. Oh, 
Okay, I'm back. We got Jonah. And uh, like I said, it changed him yesterday. So um, I'm going to put that back on the hanger. The line said, my babies don't stay in their clothes long. Um, I just changed them yesterday. They look sleepy cell. And got a beautiful skin tone. And um, what I'm gonna put him on, um, he wore it before, maybe two or three times. <laughs> yeah. Let me get him in the film, not me. Let's see. Let me do you the same way. He got snaps on the side. There you go. And I have hangers right here underneath the arm. Um, change your table so I don't have to go far to get hangers. And I just hang the outfit right on the hanger. Make it a little easy for myself. I, try, I always try to keep stuff organized and neat. Cause one thing about it, I don't like everything scattered everywhere. So I try to keep everything as neat as possible. And cause I have to, when I put away stuff, I want to be able to go back and find it. So here's a onesie. But well, like I saying about the Barbies, I'm collecting so much Barbies. And it's not the fact, um, I, I'm not trying to do a whole lot of Barbies, but the fact is I'm making a rooms and, and you know, and, and dividing them in each section and stuff like that. The problem is now is getting down on the floor and it's, and it's hard for me to be bending. Cause it hurts. It really hurts to be bending. I told my husband it'd be nice if we had that other end of the house um, closed in. I would do a, a, a table and set the barbies on the table and do they display like that. And I think that'd be a lot easier for me because I don't have to be doing all that bending. You know, cause right now I need to see what's going on. Why is my hip is um bothering me like that? But anyway, uh, like I said, all the babies got that clean on the shirt. He got his clean pamper. Um, I'm gonna put him some shorts on. And I'm putting him on some blue sandals. Jonah. I think I'm gonna put him in the room with me and um, I'm not cooking anything today we just gonna do pizza I got frustrated yesterday my husband wanted some pizza and you know you have to do it online where well, it's best to do it online cuz I tried calling and the guy put me on hold don't y'all know that man never came back on the phone to take my order and then come to find out what I did put in our address and they don't deliver anyway so I would have been you know and it was late too I told my husband this is too late for you to be eating but I, I guess because he slept all day he wasn't feeling good yesterday and shoot he slept past breakfast lunch and, um, I, and actually he ate his breakfast for lunch and dinner so I did fix him a uh, tray of, you know, like crackers and uh, salami, pepperoni. I put some grapes, a little something, a little snack. Cause when it's like nine to ten o'clock, y'all, that is too late to be eating. It really is. And I always try to eat before six o'clock anyway. And that was quick. I put, well, it was quick dressing you. supposed to have see that's some tissue here I need to always have something when I put water on it uh, I can't even get the tissue open y'all I'm gonna have to rip a hole in it I'm just back and I'm messing up. Damn. Boy. Mm -hmm. 
I do that when I'm hurry. I'm gonna hurry up and end this video. So I got him on. Just put some water on the tail. This is one beautiful baby boy. I'm not saying it because he mine, because he is beautiful. He's a beautiful baby boy. Just love his skin tone, his details, I'm telling you. Awesome. And y'all, <laughs> I went and got me some puzzles. Try to put a puzzle, uh -oh. puzzle together. I don't know if I want to do a puzzle. <laughs> I got it on the table, but I just ain't completed. That's uh, 350 pieces. I don't know. Now, when you were younger, you you know you had time to put puzzles together and stuff, but I don't know now. Um, I'm, I've been. Uh, making under stuff, you know, like undergarments for the Barbie. I'm um, trying to learn some things on YouTube. Thank God for YouTube. But um, I have a friend, the same one, that's so good on her hands, and she do all kind of craft, homemade candy and stuff like that. She is so good. She got blessed hands, and um, she told me she made doll underwear. I was like, what? And I've been trying to make them. I can't make them. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'm glad she can make them. I might have to um, get my sister to make some underwear for, for them. But here's Jonah. Oh, he's so sleepy. Yeah. He's so sleepy. Here he gone. He's so sleepy. Oh, let's see if I can get the camera down. No, I'm still making but here's his sandals. Let me pick him up. That's his sandals, y'all. He's so cute. I can't play with one. I'm gonna put him in the room. I'm gonna put him in the room with us for a little minute. I'm gonna be in the rocking glider and just um hold him. Yeah, I'm gonna hold him for a little bit. on my baby y'all not even seen your nephew <laughs> yeah, yeah he's sleepy he's sleepy he's sleepy anyway I'm gonna go but that's been going on with me my husband a lot better now thank god I guess it had to wear off so I did get some um, medication you know the one with the heart on the box Chlorocidin, I think if that's I'm, I'm pronouncing it right, because we both have high blood pressure, so we have to be careful what we take over the counter. So um, he feeling a lot better today, thank you, Lord. So anyway, y'all have a blessed weekend, enjoy, and uh, be safe out there. Even though we fully, uh, you know, me and my husband fully vac vaccinated, we are still wearing our masks. So, um, anyway, y'all be blessed, be well, we love y'all, and just know Jesus love y'all too. Alright, peace.